welcome to my class uh, dear students uh, welcome uh, this is the part uh, chapter HSC class subject chemistry chapter 2 it is second paper uh, chapter 2 organic chemistry uh, topics to this uh, topics is introduction to organic chemistry classification of organic compounds nomenclature of organic compounds this is not chemistry actually nomenclature of organic compounds nomenclature means naming of organic compounds uh, general uh, mm, general or tribal method uh, and you pick methods okay two methods so we use naming Okay, what is organic chemistry? Uh, organic chemistry is a branch of chemistry uh, which it deals with the structure, properties, synthesis, practical application of hydrocarbons and their derivative is called organic chemistry. Organic chemistry means the chemistry of more than one more compounds of carbon atom. In a organic compounds must contain carbon atom uh, so in a organic chemistry deals with the structure properties synthesis synthesis means uh, uh, preparation of compound from its elements synthesis and practical application of hydrocarbons and their derivatives is called organic chemistry organic chemistry means chemistry of more than one more compounds and carbon atoms okay you may uh, don't understand this they are derivative means hydrocarbon you know carbon and hydrogen containing compound is called hydrocarbon and wh what is their derivatives okay i am uh, showing this one derivatives like this is a carbon hydrogen compound this is hydrocarbon carbon hydrogen containing compound methane this is hydrocarbon this is four huh? this is hydrocarbon uh, this is hydrocarbon c2 h6 okay this is hydrocarbon uh, benzene is also hydrocarbon look this look mm. okay this double bond single bond double bond single bond double bond single bond okay this is benzene structure uh, we can write this is benzene this way this benzene this, uh, hybrid structure uh, benzene this way you can write so we have understood benzene is a hydrocarbon carbon and hydrogen containing compound benzene is a hydrocarbon this is benzene 
दिस इज हाइब्रिड स्ट्रक्चर बेनजिन सरी रेजुनेस स्ट्रक्चर अब हाइड्रोन हाइब्रिड बेनजिन दिस बेनजिन व्हाट इज इट्स डेरिवेटिव इफ वन हाइड्रोजन इन बेनजिन वन हाइड्रोजन इज रिप्लेस्ड बाय ओएच दिस द फेनल फेनल सो डेरिवेटिव्स ऑफ हाइड्रोकार्बन्स दिस आर आल्सो डिस्कस्ड इन ऑर्गेनिक केमिस्ट्री फेनल्स डेरिवेटिव ऑफ हाइड्रोकार्बन दिस द डेरिवेटिव ऑफ दिस द हाइड्रोकार्बन एंड दिस द डेरिवेटिव ऑफ हाइड्रोकार्बन दिस आर दिस इज हाइड्रोकार्बन एंड दिस वन फेनल इज डेरिवेटिव्स ऑफ हाइड्रोकार्बन्स लाइक दिस इज मीथेन मीथेन इज डेरिवेटिव इफ वन हाइड्रोजन इज रिप्लेस्ड बाय ओ एच ग्रुप देन सी एस थ्री एंड ओ एच दिस इज मिथानल सो डेरिवेटिव सो मिथानल इज द डेरिवेटिव ऑफ मिथेन Okay, this the branch of chemistry which deals with the structure, properties, synthesis, and practical application of hydrocarbon and their derivatives is called organic chemistry. Organic chemistry means chemistry of more than one mod, one cro crore of compounds of carbon atom. It is day by day increasing. Scientist Bergelius in 1815 assumed that organic compounds uh, obtained from plants. and animals and uh, why inorganic compounds found from lifeless substances uh, okay but his uh, assumed uh, uh proved uh, wrong by frederick bullard in 1828 he produced uh, accidentally urea by reaction between the solution of inorganic ammonium chloride and lead cyanide Uh, scientist Bergelius uh, said that uh, organic compounds only found from plants and animals, not inorganic substance. But uh, uh, Frederick Bullard proved it wrong. Has wrong. Uh, uh, he produced uh, accidentally urea by the reaction between inorganic ammonium chloride and lead cyanide. Look at this reaction. This is ammonium chloride and lead cyanide for uh, form. Ammonium cyanate. Then uh, ammonium cyanate rearrangement when heat applied uh, by rearrangement from urea. This urea is a organic compound. So we have found here uh, organic compounds from inorganic substance. organic chemistry has great contribution to every sphere of our daily life soaps detergent plastics foods products food products like uh, protein carbohydrate uh, vitamins all are uh, uh, organic products other essential products are all organic products besides this use of organic compounds as explosives medicines life saving substance medicines and fuels are also out mentioned this is organic substance uh classification of organic compounds uh organic compounds um, Uh, mainly two types open chain compound and closed chain compound this is two and is open uh two and is closed in closed chain compounds uh open chain compound two types saturated and unsaturated saturated contains uh, carbon carbon single bond unsaturated contain carbon carbon double bond triple bond carbon carbon double bond is alkene 
carbon carbon double triple bond is alkyne okay close change compound Co close change compound many two types carbocyclic and heterocyclic here uh, uh, closed change but uh, only carbon contain so this is a carbocyclic and uh, it is carbon uh, with other elements contain heterocyclic but cycle uh, ring contain it is also ring contain so cyclic uh, here is the alicyclic alicyclic uh, ring contain uh, but not benzene ring and not aromatic rings so they are alicyclic our uh, aromatic uh, ring contains compounds and aromatic these are like benzene benzene derivatives are aromatic compound are uh, heterocyclic heterocyclic uh, heteroacyclic and hetero aromatic uh, hetero alicyclic uh, uh, cycle contain but other elements contain okay heterocyclic compound uh, carbon cyclic compound uh, but in a carbon with other elements present like oxygen, nitrogen, phosphorus, mm, this are. Uh, where's my cursor? Okay, this uh, uh, this is two type, hetero alicyclic and hetero aromatic. If a aromatic compound is contain uh, different elements uh, nitrogen hydrogen they are hetero aromatic are hetero cyclic uh, this is not aromatic but uh, hetero because different uh, uh, elements oxygen contain and it is ring so cyclic Uh, homologous series uh, homologous series uh, the group of compounds the group of organic compounds formed by same elements having similar properties uh, and a common molecular formula with reference methylene group between two adjacent compounds is called homologous series look at this homologous series uh, Okay, this is uh, methane, ethane, propane, butane. This is our homologous series. Look, uh, there is a, a common general formula. This element C N H two N plus two. If I put n equal to uh, n equal to one. If I put n equal to 1, uh, if I put n equal to 1, we find methane. If I put n equal to 2, uh, n equal to 2, we find this compound. 
so they have uh, they have uh, general formula this is uh, this uh, all elements have a uh, general formula cn h2n plus 2 uh, uh, homologous series is a group of uh, group of atoms uh, which can't uh, which contains similar molecular formula have similar chemical properties and uh, there is a difference between uh, two adjacent compound methylene group look this compound here is a uh, CH3 is uh, CH3 and this is compound is CH3 CH3 and this is the difference compound this is the methylene group difference this group is called this is called methylene group so two adjacent compound difference is methylene group So the group of organic compound formed by same elements having similar uh, properties and common molecular formula with a different methylene group between two adjacent uh, compounds is called homologous series. Now functional groups. Functional group uh, in a compound uh, a group a element or group of elements which determines the properties of a compound is this group of element or group element is called functional group look this definition the atom or group of atoms in an organic compounds of a homologous series which determine the chemical properties of the organic compounds is called functional group the atom or group of atoms in an organic compounds which uh, in of a homologous series which determine the chemical properties of the organic compound is called functional group either group or group of atom or group of atoms which determine the uh, properties of a compound chemical properties of a compound is called uh, functional group of this that compound like this is a uh, all car uh, carboxylic acid uh, functional group is COH COH determine the chemical properties of carboxylic acid Sulfonic acid uh, C uh, C S O three H. Look, this is uh, nitrile aldehyde. If we see uh, S C H O, this is aldehyde C O and this O H functional group. Look, this compound. This is a methanol. This is a uh, homologous series of methanol, uh, uh, alcohol, homologous series of alcohol. Achha, in this, uh, these two compounds, which, uh, which atom or group of atoms determine the chemical properties? This OH. This OH determine the properties of this compound. So OH is called functional group of this compound. Uh, this compound, this compound, uh, OH determine the chemical properties of this compound. So OH is called functional group of this compound. Okay, this uh, this question is very important. Uh, this uh, calm question, like uh, for objective question, this sir. Uh, what is the functional uh, functional group of uh, amide amide functional group is CONH2 what is the functional group of nitrile CN what is the functional group of aldehyde CHO what is the functional group of ketone CO what is the functional group of alcohol OH like this what is the functional group of alkene carbon carbon double bond alkyne carbon carbon triple bond Okay, this functional group one is used as a prefix. Okay, the next time. Okay.
nomenclature of organic compounds that means naming of organic compounds in the beginning in the beginning of organic chemistry each new compound was given individual name all compounds has uh, was individual name uh, the ancient chemist used to depend on the success uh, and the properties for naming compounds due to synthesis of large compounds uh, this uh, ancient chemist uh, used uh, to depend on the success and properties for naming compounds but uh, uh, day by day uh, this uh, organic compounds lots of compounds mi uh, millions millions organic compounds so naming is uh, uh, by success or uh, naming from la like uh, the formic acid is named from uh, uh, this acid was found in and so this name is formic acid but is it is not possible for large uh, compounds for due to synthesis of large number of organic compounds it become very difficult to name the compounds in this basis of source or properties for naming organic compounds several uh, several regulated methods are explored name one is uh, general general or trivial method trivial method uh, derived method and uh, UPEG method, International Union of Prior and Applied Chemistry. This method used UPEG. Uh, this is uh, worldwide. This is latest uh, UPEG naming. Okay, we will learn only UPEG naming today. Uh, if we change content. Uh, contain carbon will uh, add a prefix prefix means pre uh, uh, prefix uh, the word or uh, group of word which is used uh, before the at the beginning of the word meet uh, prefix uh, it uh, if carbon chain is to it if uh, mm, if in a carbon chain uh, prop uh, number of carbon is 3 prop B, uh, number of carbon is 4 but number of carbon is uh, 3 pant uh, 5 pant number of carbon is 6 uh, hex number of carbon is 7 half uh, 8 oct uh, uh, 9 non and 10 dec Look this naming nomenclature of organic compound IUPEC method uh, nomen um, clutcher of organic compound. Okay, I will pick method. If this meet 10, mm, what is this?
mid mid and and okay this is mid and mid uh, and mid and here is a prefix uh, prefix uh, prefix is mid and suffix is n okay if the uh, prefix prefix uh, suffix is n uh, look this n suffix n if the suffix n compound will be l can homologous series l can suffix n L can okay suffix and uh, uh, this is called uh, one one carbon a meat uh, prefix is meat so one carbon in a change so what will be named this uh, compound uh, this is ends the so L can or meat uh, meat uh, okay this is L can and so what is uh, uh, general formula of alkene is uh, general formula of alkene is CN H2N plus 2 alkene okay this is uh, uh, N N uh, this N suffix N if suffix N it will be alkene uh, I showed here late here yeah? Alkan Alkan this is Alkan so general formula is uh, one so in a change is meat means uh, prefix prefix uh, meat means uh, one carbon in change so I put uh, n equal to one so what will be happen mm. uh, C carbon is 1 and if uh, uh, n equal to 1 2 into 1 2 plus 2 uh, 2 plus 2 4 so uh, CH 4 so methane is uh, 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 structural formula is methane is CH 4 and what will be structure formula of ethane ethane It and it means two. Our n means alkene. It's carbon carbon single bond alkene. So what will be general formula? Uh, two carbon. Two carbon. Okay. Uh, we know carbon has uh, four valency, so it can form four bonds. At first one bond form. Uh, here one bond form so this carbon will form uh, th uh, more three bonds uh, these three bonds uh, form with hydrogen okay uh, okay this carbon this carbon has uh, one bond so it uh, can form more three bonds uh, this three more bonds is formed with uh, hydrogen this is the ethane like then propane propane what will be uh, prop and uh, here uh, here suffix is n prefix is pop so three carbon uh, in a change uh, and n means uh, l can so carbon carbon single bond 
so we are now drawing uh, here i am doing here uh, structure formula at first uh, prop means three carbon in a chain now i am drawing this three carbon in a chain i should uh, some space here for here a space for uh, hydrogen okay okay so uh, so prop uh, for pop three carbon in a chain one two three carbon now i put a hydrogen uh, carbon can form four bonds uh, so one bond has present already uh, so uh, later for three bond will form with hydrogen okay and now this uh, this carbon this carbon already has two bonds so uh, two more two bonds with form hydrogens at uh, this carbon one bond is present so three bond will form with hydrogen okay this is the propane propane structure formula of propane Uh, now we will write this uh, uh, structure formula of uh, we learn uh, butane 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 uh, butane but means four uh, in a change four carbon contain or n means alkane carbon carbon single bond so I, uh, now I am drawing this one. Uh, at first I draw four carbon in a chain. I should take some place here. I have put some place for hydrogen. Okay. Um. Okay. Uh, this carbon, how many hydrogen will be? Uh, three hydrogen. Uh, because it has uh, one bond so it form uh, more one bonds uh, three bonds with hydrogens and this carbon has two bonds so it uh, need to form four bonds so two hydrogen add here also two hydrogen uh, uh, this carbon is three hydrogen Three hydrogen. Look, this three hydrogen. So butane is structure formula I have drawn. Uh, this is the homologous series of alkene. I have uh, tutorial uh, here learn alkene. Now we learn uh, alkene. Alkene homologous series. Alkene. Uh, alkene homologous series. Uh, this uh, it has uh, uh, we can write naming from uh, alkane name this uh, like this is a uh, first one is ethane ethane contain carbon ethane uh, here it Ethane. This N, if deduct by uh, N, E N E N, uh, replaced by in, it become ethin. It in. Like this N is replaced by uh replaced by in so ethin acha this is uh, okay this is alkin uh alkin uh alkin homologous series are uh, this functional group is carbon carbon double bond carbon carbon double bond this is the functional group of alkin so in a alkene, if we see the in, in prefix, we will say, we will understand this is a alkene, at least one carbon bond present in a compound, or it means two. 
I uh, now uh, I drawing this. I am drawing this uh, structure formula of ethene. Ethene. Uh, it means uh, prefix it means two carbon in a chain two carbon in a chain okay uh, in uh, alkene at least carbon carbon double bond so I should uh, give here one, one double bond uh, so now uh, I'll put hydrogen so uh, this carbon has uh, two double bonds so it needs two hydrogen for to form four bonds uh, is hydrogen uh, hydrogen can form four bonds so here hydrogen is uh, two bonds and uh, and uh, two bonds with hydrogen so total is four bonds with uh, carbon this carbon can form four bonds it has already two bonds and more two bonds with form with hydrogen uh, this is the structural formula of ethene Now propane. Propane. Uh, prop means three carbon in a chain. Uh, in means alkene. At least one carbon, carbon double bond. So I should uh, uh, write three uh, hydrogen, three carbon in a chain. I write. Okay. Uh, th this is alkene. I can give any uh, here any bond, a uh, double bond, at least one double bond. Present. I gi now giving here double bonds. Okay, now I put this uh, uh, hydrogen. Uh, so I this carbon has uh, two bonds, so uh, more two bonds will form with hydrogen. Uh, this carbon has two bonds here and two one bond here, so three bonds. So one bond, it one bond, will form with uh, hydrogen. Uh, this carbon has one bond, so more three bond will form with uh, hydrogen. This is the structure of propane. Uh, like butene. Uh, butene. What will be butene? at least uh, one carbon double bond this but means four in uh, four carbon in a chain or in means alkene at least one carbon carbon double bond so but means four carbon in a chain so i am drawing this in okay uh, this carbon has at least one bond is needed because this is alkene i am giving here in uh, so it uh, need two bond, need hydrogen. It need one hydrogen. Uh, it need one hy two hydrogen. Uh, because two has already uh, three. Butene. Okay, now pentene. Pant in Pant means five five carbon in a chain. Pant means five carbon in a chain. So five carbon will be here. Um, Five carbons. At first, I give this five carbon. This five carbon. Uh -huh. Okay, I have given here five carbon. I eh? uh, I can uh, in this alkene, so I should give one uh, double bond here. I give there. So it has two double bond bonds. This carbon, so. Uh, more four bond uh, more two bond is needed uh, this two bond will form with hydrogen this carbon so two hydrogen here uh, this carbon has three bonds already so one bond will form hydrogen 
every carbon can form four bonds this carbon has uh, two bonds so it form uh, more two bonds with hydrogen uh, this is also two bonds it uh, can form two bond more hydrogens more two bonds will form hydrogen uh, this carbon has one bond so it will form uh, three more bonds with hydrogen this is the pentene even naming is right this right pent pentene two pentene two uh, I should give this is numbering uh, after two carbons I'll give this two and double one will be two position like this is uh, it is specific uh, I have to give the uh, double one in the two position So this is position one, two, three, four. If this we are given like uh, pentene two, so I should give this is one position one. This is a position two. I should give position two. And, uh, so now I put now I am putting hydrogen. Uh, it need three hydrogens. Uh, it need one hydrogen. This carbon need one hydrogen. This carbon need two hydrogen. And this carbon need three hydrogen. Okay, this is C H three. Okay, not possible here. Now I am writing here again. Uh, pentene 2 I am writing against mm. uh, how many pentene 2 Look, I am doing this. How many carbon pent means four in means alkene carbon carbon double bond at uh, this double bond position is two. I should write at first five carbon. At uh, this double bond position is the two position, second position. Four, five. I should get this. This is a uh, specify double bond. Why the position two I here? Pentene two. I can do uh, put double bond any position. Uh, here I put uh, po first. If uh, not specify double bond. Here is a uh, uh, specified uh, double bond. Double bond position have to second. So I am putting this double bond second. Okay. Now put a uh, hydrogen. Uh, this carbon has one bond, so uh, more three bond will form hydrogen. Uh, okay, uh, this carbon has two bonds and one bond, three bonds, and one more bond will form with uh, hydrogen. Uh, this carbon has uh, uh, two bonds and one bond, three bonds, more one hydrogen bond form with hydrogen. This carbon has uh, uh, two bonds, uh, so it will form two more bonds with hydrogen. It has uh, one bond, so it will form more three bonds with hydrogen. So this is a pentene two, or pentene two, or pent pentene two, or Pent Pent two in 
same same structure formula paint 2 in paint 2 in or pentene 2 same structure formula paint means 5 carbon in the chain so 1 2 3 4 5 1 2 3 4 5 carbon in the chains are in means alkene double bond at uh, this double bond position is 2 so double bond position is 2 pent 2 in or pentene 2 this the structural formula okay this is the uh, class work you do this class work uh, Classwork. Write down the structural formula. Okay, this is classwork. Uh, uh, this is a recording class. Classwork is not possible. You do this uh, homework. Okay, this is classwork you're doing at home. This is homework now. Thank you for joining the class. Ah, here's the letter.